The LA Men's Central Jail has a gay unit. It's the only one in the entire country. And as KCAL 9's Rachel Kim discovered, even some straight inmates want to be housed here. We are different colors, different age groups, different backgrounds, but we all come together based on our sexual identity and our sexual preference. Apart from the general population, about 400 inmates live in K6G, the gay wing of Men's Central Jail. Sheriff's officials say the LGBT population was segregated back in the 1980s in response to an ACLU lawsuit to protect the inmates from physical violence. But in these bunked bed dorms, homosexual and transgender inmates have created their own rules, their own culture behind bars. I got to learn how to love myself here. Erica Anderson is a transgender inmate serving time for parole violations and drug use. She says K6G is a community of acceptance and support. Nicholas Stewart, a gay inmate doing time for selling drugs and credit card fraud, agrees. It's about being who you are. We embrace individuality. Sheriff's officials say some straight inmates try to get placed into K6G because it's safer than the general population where there's violence from gang and racial tensions. Deputy Javier Machado's job is to interview incoming inmates to determine whether they are really gay. The questions on there just open dialogue to see what kind of life you're living, who you're hanging around with. We do ask about, you know, gay bars or clubs or magazines. Captain Joseph Dempsey says there are very few jails in the country that segregate both gay and transgender inmates. What makes this unique is all the programming that we give them, all the services we give them to try and reduce recidivism. Reporting from downtown Los Angeles, Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News.